me to speak in English. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and it's uh, it's impressed. I was uh, quite impressed the number of microphones here. Uh, and thank you again, uh, President Sankoki, uh, for your kind words, warm welcome, and for your great hospitality. I am very pleased to be here today representing the International Monetary Fund. On my first visit, on my first visit to Suriname. I had a very, very fruitful meeting with President Santoki and Vice President Brunswick. Thank you very much. And earlier with the Minister of Finance and the Central Bank Governor to discuss Suriname's economic opportunities and challenges. In my discussion with President Santoki, I commended the authorities for the strong implementation of policies and reforms under the program, and of course, under the very strong leadership of the President. And this Strong implementation helped achieve the long awaited macroeconomic stabilization in this country. The near term priority is to hold step fast to the achievement that have been secured even after the current EFF program ends. Specifically, this includes four points. First, maintaining a tight fiscal stance to put debt on a firmly downward path and building economic resilience to future shocks. And of course, at the same time, it is important to expand social assistance programs so that the poor and vulnerable are protected. That is uh, my first point. Maintaining a tight fiscal stance with firm protection to the poor and vulnerable. Second, raising spending on growth enhancing infrastructure projects to support the economic recovery. Third, maintaining the central bank independence. The tight monetary policy stance was critical in bringing down inflation and should be maintained as inflation remains elevated. Fourth and finally, pushing ahead with broader governance reforms to strengthen the anti-corruption legal framework. And President Santuki and I talked about what the IMF can do to support these efforts. As you know, IMF has a close working relationship with Suriname. We are proud of providing policy advice, capacity development, including training to public officials, and, of course, financial support under the EFF program. We will continue to work closely with the authorities in the period ahead to help Suriname 
to help Suriname maintain macroeconomic stability and enhance growth prospects. I really look forward to working with the President and his team to strengthen the prospects for Suriname's economic recovery and to support the country's medium-term economic development for Surinamese people, including the future generations. Thank you very much.